Good morning, May. Oh yeah, Dad moved the boxes in the crawl space, didn't he? Now we can actually get in here. What the heck? There's the code we got earlier from shelf. What the hell? It's an old tooth? Yeah, that's a tooth. Granddad put a tooth in a safe in the basement. Welp. Never know when you'll need an extra tooth. You and me, tooth. We're gonna go far. I'll take it. Mysterious tooth. Hey, Mom. Mm-hmm. Um, what's wrong? Nothing's wrong. Do you feel like talking about school yet? Yeah, sure, Mom. What's the story? I just felt like it wasn't where I should be. Where you should be. What does that even mean? Ugh, never mind. Let's talk about this later. Any idea when you might want to do that? Because, honey, I am all ears. I really am dying to find out why you decide to up and abandon all the plans we'd made as a family. <laughs> Jeez, Mom. Where is this coming from? You know you're the f first Borowski to go to college. Yeah, Mom, I know. I only heard that since I was like six. Well, honey, we've been planning for it since you were born. Spent a good 18 years and got into all kinds of trouble. Just for you to decide you'd rather be here. Might as well have taken all that effort and money and worry and dumped it in a hole. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> May's face, too. Are you like having one of your mood swings again? May, don't be a piece of shit. Hug like I'm the moody one in this house. You are the moody one in this house. Well, enjoy this house while we still have it. What? What's happening to the house? Maybe it just isn't where we should be. Uh, Mom, this isn't funny. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about anything. Why start now? Go off and do whatever it is you do. You know what? Maybe if I'd had more examples of, you know, getting out and making something of myself. No, no, you do not get to. Maybe you wanted me to get out of here, because you never got around to doing it yourself. Maybe I'm just the most recent failure in the line of failures that is our family. Oh, May, don't say these things. I'm leaving now. I'm sorry, Mom. May's being a piece of shit today. Ooh, that was rough. May, what the fuck is your problem? Like, Mom is stressed about money, and meanwhile May is getting up at 2 p.m. every day and not getting a job. Whoa, decorations. Girl, you can't mess around on Halloween. Jeez. Wanna hear a new poem? Sure. Bats and moon against the gloom. The night is black. I made a snack. Cool. I microwaved pizza I'd saved. Though pizza cold is breakfast gold. <laughs> That's so true. It really happened. Oh, hey, the poem guy, the fisherman, isn't here tonight. Time to steal a pretzel for the rat babies. Got him. This is unfairly easy now. Oh, look at this kid. Where is everybody? Mmph, mmph. What? Mmph, mmph. Oh my god, we used to do that. Awesome. Mmph, mmph, mmph. Well, you go easy on my street. There's something wrong with this kid. Deal. I hope he's okay. Wonder if mom's still pissed at us. I'm busy. Yep, mom doesn't want to talk to us right now. The statue of Saint Rubello. Yeah, the fire breathing guy. Who like eight people. That's a bit of an oversimplification. But yeah, basically. Cool guy to have a statue of. Outside the church, I mean. Well, I didn't put it here. Can't we learn something from Saint Rubello? <laughs> Breathe fire. Sure. This statue is part of our Encourage Criminal Acts outreach. It's working. How's the situation? The situation? With Bruce and stuff. Eh. We wait and see. And pray. There's Bruce. You gonna go down to Harfest tonight? Don't know, maybe. Keep to myself. You should say hi if you're there. I'll be there. Okay. We'll see, I suppose. Bruce is so chill. I like Bruce. Alright, my little miracle rats. Time to eat. Wow, there's so many of you. Someday you won't need me anymore, and you'll leave. 
if I even recognize you on the street as we pass each other. I love you, Miracle Rats. 87th Annual Possum Springs Har Fest brought to you by the Possum Springs Chamber of Commerce. Hey, y'all, uh, mall cop. Mall cops don't carry guns, May. Jeez. I guess you need that gun for... What are you doing? Blocking off the road. Oh yeah, you wouldn't want to do that without a gun. You know how many times I've shot someone? No, tell me now. Once. You kill him? No. So you're saying you don't really need it then? You should carry a battle axe. That would be impressive. I'll look into it. Hey, here's Lori. You hype for Harfest? Uh, Harfest is pretty dumb, right? I want to watch a bunch of old Dracula movies from the 60s. That actually sounds really cool. It is going to get a pizza too. All to myself. Wow, you have life way more figured out than I did at your age. Really? What were you doing then? Hanging out in really embarrassing places online. Yep. Happy Halloween. Haha, <laughs> hey, you too. You feeling spooky? Oh, extremely, can't you tell? Do your spooky face. <laughs> he just moved his ears a little. Angus, you're just smiling. And it's adorable, not scary. Oh. Nice effort, though. Hey, man. How's things? Good, Harfest Rush. No one's in here. You missed it. The horror. Oh. I done got horrored. Getting horrored at work is the worst. When I had that job that one time, I worked the longest night rush. You know, you've never mentioned having a job. Uh, that's a story for another time. Anyway, you're here now, and I'm here now, and it's a lovely day. I always worried I'd have to smash these light bulbs all by myself, so what's up? Uh, I'm very interested in this light bulb smashing. Hell yeah, dude. Damn it. Throw better. <laughs> ah! Dude! <laughs> ah, there's one. Ah, <laughs> dick. <laughs> he just looks at you. I did the math on how much these things cost. 67 cents. Ah, I'm never ready for the can. <laughs> oh, we're stopping because I get hit three times. Oh, hey. You can just play songs right in your room. Let's try... This wasn't in here last time I played this game. There's the space dragon. How the hell do you draw a space dragon? Alright, let's get ready for Harfest. She's dressed up as a witch dagger. Oh, that's such a cool outfit. Oh, look at that snarky cat looking out the window at me. Interestingly, I can't jump in this. The decor is nice, though. Dare you spin the wheel of destiny? Explain. No one can explain the power of the wheel, save that it is an unknowable circular soothsayer. Oh snap, is it gonna say the sooth? The sooth shall be said. Okay, I'm into this. I have no idea how to play this minigame. Is your arm injured? It's a little sore lately, actually. I can tell, I see all. Your fortune is your future, a place you will soon be. Forever. Okay, that checks out. Your card says much. There is something you want, and you shall have it. And yet there is something else you desire, and it shall ever elude you. Oh, come on. That's not a fortune. That's just like the human condition or whatever. Welcome to the Harfest Spooktacular Water Balloon Toss. You know what to do. I guess we just throw water balloons at this guy. I'm a scary spirit and I've been hit. Oh, gonna haunt you for that. I am extremely cold and wet. God, he's so fast. I want to get him at least once. Ha ha! You hit me, the pumpkin. <laughs> Ha 
behalf of the Possum Springs Town Council, we urge you to support local business. Enjoy our historic home. Awesome Springs more like... Kathleen, no. More like Awesome Springs. Uh. Okay, we're done. Oh, there's the parade. Here's the judgmental teenagers in the background. Right, guess we're going to the old pickaxe for that play. When's this thing supposed to start? Uh, ten minutes, I think? You think? This is a nightmare. Why did I ever agree to do this? Chamber of Commerce owes me big for this. Okay, so here's the thing. You won't have many lines. What? <laughs> I've had like three no-shows. Why? Because this whole thing is stupid and nobody cares about it. B. Please, it's a fun part. B. Yeah. I will totally save your ass. You got like five minutes to look at your lines. Psh, I can wing it. May, please don't wing it. <laughs> that face. Through the mists of time, I see weary fur trappers from 1793. From this vantage point, I do spy a deep hollow, and within a great dead tree, and besides with, uh, which, a spring. Blessed are we, Brother Stephen, for truly my throat is parched from these long and arduous travels and carrying 300 beaver pelts. Oh, travelers, help an extremely old woman. Uh, please help. Uh? Oh no, I am made of cobwebs from being so old. Haggard witch, horrible to look upon. Cruel young men, ye did not even offer one of thy 300 fine beaver pelts to warm my ancient bones. I shall curse ye and thee, and this very night ye shall perish. Yee I was born among these trees neath the harvest moon, and ye shall die under that moon. Brother John, I am frightened. Faith, Brother Stephen, art thou so easily shaken by the ramblings of an old crone? Come, help me carry these three hundred beaver pals. You're in this? Yep. Ah, witch. Yep. I swear thee, fiend, that this very day this horrifying crone did curse my brother and I to die. Zwounds. Well, <laughs> Even now his body lieth upon the earth, lifeless as a pile of three hundred beaver pelts. Oh, it chilleth the heart. Eehehehe. I did curse this spring that any man who drinketh from it shall perish. Arg, I am slain. I join thee now, Brother Stephen. Wow. I am also undone, for I have drinketh of the water. Don't leave me here, Greg. Bye. <laughs> Brother, we are now ghosts. I am tormented by the accusing glare of 300 ghostly beavers. <laughs> for what is a ghost but that which haunts the empty space that was once full? And once haunted, can a place be unhaunted? Oh, hey, it's the janitor. You! From the bus station! Young witch, it is I, the god of the forest. Uh, just didn't expect you to ain't that the way. So, which thou hast tarried too long in this world, I banish thee to wander in the night through the stranger places. But we begin and we end at night in the woods, but that is not the whole of the story. This is your line. Forest God, thou hast no power here. Even now thy end beginneth. Ach, my infernal powers. Beware as you go, for there are ghosts. Woo, take care. <laughs> Oh god, this play. And so was founded then this festival on Halloween we shall celebrate the dying of the year and the founding of Possum Springs. The beaver population suffered a decline and now our biggest exports are corn and pumpkins. Now leave before I curse you all. Oh no, audience, and that's our show. Support your spooky local businesses. <laughs> Jeez, thanks guys. I am never doing that again. So what are we doing now? Well, I'm going home. Angus is making dinner and we're gonna watch horror movies. Can I come? It's more a date thing. What are you doing, B? Chamber of Commerce folks are going to the buffet out by Ham Panther. Kinda have to go. Business stuff. I hate this. Good night. Night. This is garbage. Oh shit! Are, are you seeing this, May? 
What the? Oh my god. Hey, anyone? Shit. Just got spoopy for Halloween. Where the hell did he go? That fucking creep. May, go home. There's a guy up there on the hill. He stole some kid. You look like a ghost. A ghost, huh? Or something like that? May, you shouldn't be out here, doing whatever it is you're doing. No, no one should be out here. But there's this guy. I'll drive you home, May. No! May, now. That teenager got fucking nabbed. Where the hell are we? Hearing some shit. The fuck? I feel like I'm about to get jump scared. No, it was just an ominous rumbling sound. Part 3, The Long Fall. What the hell was all that? Jeez.